Yeah, actually we decided to, uh, to uh, upgrade things a bit and uh, put a cover over our yard. Sort of went a little bit bigger uh, to make it more convenient. Uh, good for working the cattle, excess machinery and so forth after, as well as running our own bull, bull sales and so forth. He's right up in that 600 day figure at plus 81 and he's 3.4 on that scrotal. Right up in that IMF at, pl at positive 0.3, a real deep, soft, easy flushing bull with a huge hind quarter. It's made working to stock during the, in the summer an absolute pleasure to work in the, in the heat and in the wet, wet weather during winter, when, instead of traipsing, traipsing around in knee deep mud, well, yeah, everyone's dry and makes, especially record keeping with paperwork and whatnot, makes it a lot easier. But the shed itself, uh, we're very, very uh, happy with. Magnificent uh, construction, it's very strong. Very tight, it looks very tidy and neat and definitely very solid in construction. And it fits into our uh, situation here very well. Probably the biggest uh, problem, as I said a while ago, uh, I wish we'd done it probably 20 or 30 years ago. The builders did a magnificent job and very timely and efficient, working over the top of yards, which we were still using at the time of um, them building the shed. I'd have no hesitation in recommending the Spanlift crew to, to build a shed for anyone else again and I would definitely then building another shed for us in the future. Yeah, actually it's something that we're very proud of anyhow.